What's up, everybody? Welcome to Retro Rando. You know what time it is. It's Monday. It's time to spin the fancy wheel. See what we're coming up with this week. It's, um... Normally, we do this Saturday afternoons. That's the time I normally pick. Looks like we're getting N64 in the meantime. Uh, while I'm doing some stuff here, I'm gonna give you guys a fun story of what I've been going through. So, I was supposed to record this Saturday morning like I always do. That's always when... I normally record these. It is mid Sunday afternoon and it was not a case of forgetting so much as uh, shit happened that made me not think about having to do this. So I woke up super early Saturday morning. My brain is to a point now that I used to be like a nocturnal guy. Like I used to be up till two in the morning waking up at nine. And as we now transition to the uh, the the only console that doesn't have an optical illusion on the wheel. You spin that sucker and see what we're getting. But uh, I normally wake up, used to wake up around like 8, 9 o'clock. Now, a lot of the times I'll get up at 6 despite what I want to do. We're getting some sort of Pokemon game, it looks like. Pokemon Stadium. All right. Cool. We're actually getting some decent stuff uh, once in a row here. But um, I uh, I got myself up at 6 because my brain just hates me now. And I'm like, well, what the hell am I going to do? And I said, well, screw it. Like, I've been trying to go on more uh, walks. And, then, and I said, you know what, screw it. I'm going to go outside, go for a walk. And then I figured, you know what? I haven't yet because I already play softball and such. And I generally try not to overdo it too much. I'm like, screw it. Let me go for a run. I'll do that and see what happens. And, you know, I go on my route that normally is about, like, just shy of an hour of a walk. And I went out there and, you know, here and there would, would do bits of running because I'm horribly out of shape. So I did the best I could with what, you know, I can currently do at this point. And everything was fine. Didn't seem like anything was wrong. And then all of a sudden, you know, it, it gets to a juncture where I suddenly am having like a lot of trouble, like walking, like it really feels really rough. And I'm trying to figure out why and it doesn't quite work out that way. So I eventually, you know, I go inside afterwards, try to see what's going on there, and I look down, and my, uh, I realize that at some point, hopefully see that the uh, N64 footage is lining up properly on my, on, yeah, it's, it's good enough. So we'll do that. And, you know, I got to a point where I realized that I don't know why, I don't know if maybe my shoe dug into it or somehow like a nail was was digging into it. A good chunk of my uh, of the uh, of my small toe on my left foot was just like hanging. Like I have a hole about the size of I don't know, like a like a pencil eraser taken out of my out of my foot and it's red underneath. Like it's not like I took just a little bit of skin off. No, I took a good chunk out. And for the rest of the day, I've been nur I was nursing that. Still today, is as I'm going, it like it hasn't really healed at all yet. I mean, granted, with that much skin gone, it's gonna take a second to heal. So I'm sitting there being like, all right, you know, I'm just gonna be limping for the rest of the day, and because of that, completely forgot. And now here we are, you know, at least 24 hours later, eh, about like 30 ish from when I normally would have recorded, and I just realized, oh crap. I might miss another week of Retro Rando. I should probably fix that. So here we are. So let's just start the timer now. We know we're going to be able to get our times worth of Pokemon Stadium. It's Pokemon freaking Stadium. Now the question is... Weren't there minigames in this? I don't remember anymore. Was it two that had the minigames? Eh. Well, we got that too. Um, I forget what most of these modes do. Because I think, yeah, this is just a regular battle as an event. But I think those mini games must be in the next game. I could have sworn that they were. This is also the coolest thing that I remember too, was actually being able to play like the Game Boy versions of Pokemon on your TV like that. It's something that I miss. Yeah, these are all just, okay. So I, I think, because unless like there's something here, but I don't think there was. Oh, okay. I don't remember what any of these are. Well, you know what? We shouldn't play mini, mini games right off the bat with... All right, let's go play some Stadium. 
see how the old uh, how the old noggin's working with it. So I guess it doesn't really matter, does it? Yeah, just go with that. I have no idea what's good or not. I don't remember. We're just playing and finding out how the hell I do. So. Okay. Yeah, I can only do rental. So. Let's go with what I remember that I would normally use. So, I mean, right off the bat. Oh, they don't give you Mewtwo. Well, never mind then. Um, I mean, I figure I must have been using these in some capacity. It's like, that's the other thing too. Like, some of these things with their stats, it's like, hmm. Because what else we get? That was Gyarados in those days. Yeah, he's got a high amount of attack. The special is not as high, though. And I'm kind of forgetting what I used to run with for such a long time. I, also, you can never remember, too, because you also at one point would have been using um, the, uh, the ones that I would have had like on my own system being brought over. So there's also that. Definitely would have been using Alakazam, that's for sure. Okay. Now we go back to the OGs. But they're not like super amazing. I mean, they're like super well rounded, which is great. The other thing too, it's like you got the rentals. Like, hey, do you want you know the weak version of them or the? That's the only downside I guess you have with these is that you're always kind of like incentivized to never pick the the OGs when you're in certain modes. But yeah, so because we're it's OG, we just do all these and then who do I add into that? Good enough. We'll see how well that goes. Well, I guess it's gonna be relatively easy to start. So, he's got a bunch of normals, some fighters. So, Gengar for sure. Golem, oh God, I forgot what the C button is. There it is. Uh, and I'm trying to remember weaknesses. <laughs> what's, what's, uh, Alakazam way too? I'm not even going to risk it. Uh, ask her. We'll still put him in there. We're finally underway with Pokemon Tournament Pokecup Pokeball. We have a large contingent of Pokemon with a bewildering mix of moves. Okay. Now. Here's the first move. Bonk. Yeah. See, now I'm having to remember all the, uh, there are probably Pokemon fans that are gonna watch this and be like, how do you not remember what's weak to what? It's like, bro, I'm sorry. I haven't played a Pokemon game in a long time. I was also at the point too that like, I don't play Pokemon the way that you're probably supposed to. I just had like four attacks and would just like outpower everything. So like, it's the same way with JRPGs as a whole. If I ever have to like properly play it in the way of like, I have to use status effects and such, I'm terrible for that shit. Also just noticing how like, 
Machop looks like he's like disheveled on it because you can what? see his what? rib cage on one side, but then he's also jacked everywhere else. Oh, it's hit the lead. Are you gonna kick what you, what's a ghost? It don't work. Yeah, it sure was a hit. It is brief, it's the heated battle rages on. What will it do? It just seems like that one does more damage, even though it's the thing too. I don't remember what attacks hurt more, so I'm just like that one. There's a difference in the number of reserve Pokemon. I do remember that line all the time. I don't care if it's if it's legit or not. The correct answer is Ekans. We all know that. Okay, bye. Hooray! I won because he all carried like first tier. Hooray! The question is, is, do I get to a certain... Nope, we're still in the same stage. Oh boy. Okay, so we got three electrics and three grass. So immediately, Charizard's gonna be a must. Uh, we can't, we can't, well, we could, I mean, we could bring Golem, but it's only assuming that he doesn't use, that he doesn't have any, uh, hmm, yeah, I'll still bring him. Although I don't remember just making sure that I had my selections the way I wanted them. Okay. What kind of battle can we expect to see? Begin round two. And also, like, it's weird. It's like it's like with the old with the original Pokemon games. It's really weird to see um, to see Pikachu not making a cute sound. It always throws me off. Hey, what are we gonna do now? That's right, nothing. Honk. Although it's like it's not very effective, but still crit, so it almost kills him. Miss. I don't remember what Swords Dance was, but it's 30, so it's got to be a, a physical attack of some kind. Oh, no, never mind. Uh oh, this could be paral paralysis. No! I should have just used fire spin. They go into battle poses. What this? A decent hit. Ew. Whirling fire spin. That's a good hit. I'm sorry, Pikachu. Is it down and out? I'm sorry. Oh yeah, this, this thing's getting fucked up. This is a fight between two different types of Pokemon. What'll it do? Oh, the attack missed! Well, so far the paralysis hasn't done anything. Expecting a, a paralyze on this one. Yep. It's paralyzed on the spot. 
That was just, that was to be expected after that many uh, runs in a row. He's like, all right, I'm done playing with my food. Bye. I love that thing, though, of like, oh, taken down in one hit. It's like, bro, that's always been Pokemon. If you're strong enough, you hit him with a super effective attack. It's going to just kill it. Has this guy ever watched Pokemon battle before? Well, five turns, only one paralyzed. Not bad. Ah. Rude. Like he's just slowly whittling this Charizard down. I'm just trying to finish it off. There it is. I think we do one more and then we go into the minigame side because that's all I really want to do. I'm not going to lie, like, if this is Pokemon Stadium 2, I don't even know if I'd play actual Pokemon battles because all I remember from Stadium 2 is all the, the minigames. Okay, this one's going to be a little more interesting to deal with. Um... See how that goes. Upcoming battle looks promising. We're into round three. Does Ash got a Machoka bitch? Uh, well, let's see if I remember if that's effective or not. Okay, good. I haven't all forgotten everything. Cool. That's all I need to know. And I got an even fight. Ish. The remaining Pokemon count is three to two. This battle is still up in the air. I don't remember what Metronome goes. Oh right, is it like a copy? No! I knew that was gonna happen. No! No. No dream. Yeah, she just got my thunder. Eh. What's that? Eh. That's a bit. Fireworks are flying in this battle. What's this? There, it's a hit. No, he ain't dead yet. Oh, is Metron just like literally a completely random spell? That's interesting. I don't remember. To, uh, to give people a sense of like just how much Pokemon I've ever played. So I grew up with obviously red and blue and yellow. I did play gold, silver, crystal. I tried to play ruby, sapphire, and that's where it cut off for me. I have tried playing XY. That's the la like the most recent one that I tried to play was XY, and I didn't get very far because it just wasn't clicking. I think Pokemon games like just had their shelf life with me as a kid, and then it just it's never clicked since. The remaining Pokemon count is 
Like, I'm playing this, like, I don't mind it, but I'm not sitting here being like, oh my god, this is amazing. This is, like, everything I remember. Like, it's more like, me. Mind you, also, Pokemon Stadium, even as a kid, like, it wasn't the best Pokemon game. It was just having Pokemon battles in a much more, like, visceral manner. Like, it, was, it felt, like, much more real than how it used to be, obviously, on Game Boy, where it was just a pixel char a caricature of the Pokemon just doing a little shimmy shake and then an attack happened, whereas this actually felt more like an actual battle taking place. So we're undefeated. Shocking, I know. We haven't even gotten towards the end where they actually start throwing some heavier stuff at us. But me. Oh, I can always come back to it. I probably won't. But we go back to the little stuff. Oh, I don't want to continue it. I just want to go. I just want to go there. Okay. I don't remember which each of these are. I want to. I gotta start with this one first. Oh, normal, I guess. Oh, so it's the mini game thing. Okay. Okay. Remember the arrows on the blackboard near the teacher tells you into the arrow direction. Okay. Oh, I remember this game. Alright, now how bad how bad is do they screw up already? Yep. <laughs> so freaking cute. Uh oh. I think the controller missed my first input. <laughs> no. No. Okay, I don't know if I got it right this time. I don't quite remember the last two, but I think I got it. Sorry, right, they're making way more mistakes now. Hey. Okay. Okay, that shouldn't be. I should be able to do that. Still haven't done a right, which is also a. That would be the real curveball to throw that one in. I love how they all made mistakes and then immediately remembered all of it the second time around. Nope, we're still never doing it. Okay. Crap. I think that's right. I e I've either... I'm either perfect or I've made two mistakes, but the AI is probably going to make way more mistakes. Yeah. They've taken away everything that they had. There we go. Hurrah! I'm a genius. Like, the um, the other thing that I like the most about Pokemon Stadium 2 was they had trivia in it, and I'm a huge trivia guy, so that was always a, a must for me. Okay. This is going to be interesting. Oh my god, I actually got one. I don't think I would get the one on the first try. Mm. Oh, it's too much! How do I... How, how do I do the middle one? I can't figure out the middle one! I'm barely holding it! Okay, I gotta give up on that. Go to this one. No! No! I'm blowing it. I'm blowing it. What? No. I j no. What? Oh my god, I... Is the controller just not taking my input now? 
No! Yeah, now I'm like getting nothing here. Oh no, I need that. I need that. No! Shit! No! Oh. <laughs> You know, I thought I figured it out, and then all of a sudden the game's like, actually. This is on N64 controller, I would have been better. This is weird, I started off fine, and then after that I went like, no. Okay. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Oh boy. Oh, I have to hold it. Well, I feel stupid now. Okay, yeah. Yeah, this, this is not going as well as I'd like to. I mean, we're... Almost surviving, but not quite. I don't have enough. Yeah. For some reason, that it was a touch, not a hold. You know, I thought I was going to have three easy wins here, and I'm quickly realizing that my own limitations of mental capacity are actually preventing me from doing this. Hey. Also, that game is short. Damn. Could have done a little more work of it. Also, I barely won that. And I'm a good button masher. I don't know if I would have won this on hard in any ca in any capacity. Get it? I think this was my favorite. I'm pretty sure this is my favorite out of all of them. Okay, so... Remember we want the premium shit. No, give me that. I want shit. No. No, stop. It's my no, no. I want that. No, that's not what I want. No. Give me, give me, give me, you fucker. Oh. Yeah, I got the big one. It's all I... It's the important one. No! No! Need that. Gimme. I think I won? Yeah. Oh wait, no I didn't. Damn. I'm really fighting for my life here. I might actually, there's a potential I could lose. Well, shit. I'm expecting that when I started playing this game. Okay. Okay, we should be fine. It's just timing. Uh-oh, I shouldn't say that out loud. I shouldn't say this out loud. <laughs> oh! Okay, so I just collectively won with a computer. Don't know how I feel about this. I don't know how I feel about this.
So I just need to get the other ones I haven't done yet. So I think we only missed, what, two? Yeah, the Sancher and the Ratatat one. Okay. Huh? Huh? Oh, I just gotta go faster. Okay. I thought I thought there was a little bit more timing to it. Okay, we'll try that again now that I actually know what the hell I'm doing. There we go. There we go. Screw all y'all, this is my game. And then that leaves. Run, Rattata, run. Oh, that's why I said Rattata, Rattata, I'm, yeah. Uh-oh. Okay, again. I misread the controls. I thought I was going with the analog stick. I realized as soon as I started, I'm like, it was not that. Yeah. No! Yuck. Yuck. No! So we've learned that I am still incapable of playing kids' games. Hooray! Is there anything else? That's the Hall of Fame. That's just free battle. This is just the lab. And this was the actual... Because that was just the actual, like, uh... Big piece. Yeah, it was, like, just all the leaders. Yeah. Um, I'm just gonna cap it here. I know we're almost at 30 minutes. I mean, there's not really much else I can do unless I just do, like, another battle, which... We know that until I get to the later half, it's not gonna matter. Um... This was cool though. It's been a while since I've played a Pokemon Stadium game. I actually tried to recently uh, with friends on Switch, but for whatever reason, we couldn't get the controls to work. So it was weird. We just couldn't get into it. And I really want to play it just for the mini game. So hopefully one day I'll get Pokemon Stadium 2 rolled here and I'll be able to do that there. Because out of all of them, like that's like I said, that's the one that I really want to play because the mini games there are way better. And like I said, there's a the trivia. That's what I really want. I want to play the trivia just to see how much I still remember. Cause it's been a long time. When I um when I dated my first girlfriend, this is when I was like 18, 19. That's what I did, is I went to her place. The first thing we did together was play Pokemon Stadium at and at her house, and I killed it on the trivia. And I hadn't played Pokemon Stadium since at least before I was a teenager. And I hadn't really played Pokemon much at before that either. Or after that either, I should say. And that was just I was kicking ass. And I can't wait to see just how much I've forgotten. I'm pretty sure because it's like original two generations, I have a good chance of remembering most of it. However, that being said, I don't remember too much about the second generation anymore. I barely, I don't remember. I don't think I remember all the, I remember, I remember the three starters, Chigarita, Totodile, Cyndaquil. I do remember Blaziken. And that's the only one I think I remember in terms of names between those three. I don't remember a lot of the the second generation. That's almost completely passed by. If you put me in front of a Sporacle quiz for the 150, I would get almost all of that in the time limit. And there would be like just a few that I don't remember. The, 100, the original 151, I should say, that I still remember at the back of my hand. But anything beyond that is, uh, it, it's not great. But anyways, that's going to do it for this week on Retro Rando. Hopefully by then uh, I'll have a foot that I can walk on again. That'd be cool. But apart from that, obviously you guys know the drill. Like the video, subscribe to the channel for more content. Remember, every Monday we have these suckers go up. Every Wednesday is the main show. Every Friday is the side quest. All of those go up at noon. Don't forget the link tree, which you can see in the description of this video, which will give you a link to the Discord, link to all of our socials, all that sweet stuff. And we will see you on the next one. Take care. Bye-bye for now.